Good morning, doing my chores on the Flanagan Homestead this morning. Got a little bit of drizzle, but that's all right. Uh, we need some rain in the summer. Uh, I'm gonna try to capture one of my chickens laying an egg this morning, and if I can catch it, uh, we're gonna see how long it takes for the bloom to dry. The bloom is a moist uh, protein layer around the outside of the leg, uh, the egg, and it seals the pores of the egg so that bacteria and whatnot can get, not get in. So uh, it's kind of like pouring concrete and then putting a sealer on top of it uh, so that the pores are closed up. And uh, so let's see if we can capture a chicken laying an egg and then see how long it takes for the bloom to dry. Mm, there we go. This is a barred rock. You can see how shiny and moist it is right now because of all the bloom on it. That'll begin to evaporate in the next few seconds here. The bloom does not evaporate off but more seals up on the egg and hardens and protects it from bacteria on the inside. It's almost dry now. You can see a wet yellowish streak across the top still. And just a tiny bit left on the top right. And now it looks like it's completely sealed off bloom. And that, my friends, is what you call farm fresh eggs. Well, we did it. We were able to capture a chicken laying an egg. Uh, I'm not surprised it was one of my barred rocks. They're the calmest, most friendly birds, and they don't mind me just standing there staring at them. Uh, they're very friendly. So thanks for joining me on the Flanagan Homestead, where Christmas trees are my business, teaching, including horticulture, is my job, and outdoor projects like taking care of chickens are my passion.